Welcome back to the shop. I know I just posted a video. Well, I think I'm gonna do another one since it's been so long. Same piece of wood. This wood is like gotta be about five five feet long. Um, so I'm not like I said, I'm not sure what kind of wood this is. Um, it's definitely not pine. It smells good because it was just cut not too long ago. I think I'm going to do an emerging goblet. I've been wanting to try to do one, and I think I'm going to do one. So I'm going to have to start off turning it between centers. This side's not flat. My chainsaw skills stink. You can see how weird that is. That's my chainsaw skills. They suck. They stink. So I'm going to find center best I can. It should be okay. Bourbon mallet. Ouch. Move your finger. Just pound that in. I pinched my finger. Put that in here. get this on on here between centers and then I'll rip it. Okay, here we go. I got this between centers. Gonna raise you up a little bit so you can see the leg. Don't mind my hand. So this is this long. <laughs> um it's about Eight inches long. So I'm gonna do is I'm gonna separate this piece here, cut that off completely, make it go away. So that's flat. And then I'm gonna do a mortise. And I'll probably have the goblet here. It's a little stem, and then just leave this the way it is, leave the bark here. So it looks like it's coming out of the bark, out of the tree itself. So Let's try to do that without hurting myself. So I'm gonna probably sharpen up some of my tools because I think they're pretty dull. And uh, when I come back, they'll be nice and sharp and they'll start turning. All right, hopefully they're nice and sharp. My sharpening skills are not the greatest. So, <clears throat> can you see? Like I said, I'm gonna part this off here and uh, flatten this. All right, I decided I'm just gonna do a mortise. Tendon, whatever it is, the, like the one I did on the other bowl.
Okay, so now I'm gonna start doing the bowl for the goblet, the cup for the goblet. And hopefully this works. Kind of see where I'm going with this. It's gonna be a goblet. It's probably gonna stop right here. It's probably gonna be the top of the cup. Right here. Um, the bowl, stem, and then the piece of wood's just gonna look like it's coming out of the wood. So. I might just, who knows, I might just come here and just take it off there. Bring some of that out of it. I'll figure it out as I go. So I'm gonna do some of this off camera so I don't bore you to death. Maybe I'll speed it up. Okay, so, kind of got it roughed out how I want it. I'm going to bring this up a little bit, I think. Just cut it in. Uh, yeah. Just bevel it, I guess, a little bit. So, and make it look like there might be a little um, rim. This is going to go thinner, but I want to do the bowl first before I take that any thinner. Um, I think we'll do the bowl now. I'll tell you right now, this sap of water coming off this thing is really cold. So, let's do that a little bit. Move my light so I can see what I'm doing. enough so it moved it.
All right, I'm gonna try to fix this. And I'll be back. There. It's not perfect, but it's gonna warp anyway when I when it dries. this dry for a few days probably quite a few days before I completely finish it try not to say a lot so I'm gonna speed through a lot of it you guys can see what I'm doing and not have to listen to me go <laughs> like chipmunk so so far that's what I have for an emerging goblet it's pretty Cool. I'm trying to give it a little more character than it would have with just the wood grain and stuff. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna let it dry for a few days. 
probably quite a few days. I'm gonna, I'm gonna find my so we can see how wet this really is. Let's see. Thirty, thirty percent moist. Third, twenty-nine percent, thirty-two, thirty-one percent moisture. And that's fifteen percent, but it feels like it's soaking rain and wet. So I let it dry for a little bit in the air, and. Uh, See what's gonna happen. See how I can get a little play with it. So hopefully it doesn't crack here. If it cracks, it cracks. I guess we'll just figure that out. So that's it for now. See you in a couple days.